Ibo Ibo, Mamano. It is me again, High Chief Awuse Golden Sea, the Oracle of the Mbwe Mekem Bonambo of the Holy Kedron Nalek Mwebere. Oh yes. In this episode, I want to make a reaction to a particular video that has been trending online for a couple of days now. I want to make this reaction as a custodian of the Igbo culture and tradition. Alright, first and foremost, I'm going to play the video so that you see by yourself. After which, I will make my reaction. Alright, just check out the video. Now you've seen the video. I just wanted to know that what you just saw is a typical aberration to our uh, Igbo culture. Mau or Mo as some people call, which, which obviously refers to masquerade in Igbo culture is one that is sacred. The coming out of the masquerade in Igbo land is always in two types. There are two types of masquerade. One is purely for entertainment, whereas the other one is for spiritual exercise. Now, the one for entertainment has no deity that is attached to it, that is linked with it, that controls it. Why the other one is for spiritual significance? There's this Igbo adage that says, Nukumau pota obremau abawaso. So, the Nukumau there is referred to the original masquerade that is thrown or that is linked with a particular deity. It doesn't just come out anyhow, it comes out at festive periods, at a particular festive period, especially one that is significant to that land or to the village or to the community. That is when the bigger masquerade comes out, that is when the main masquerade comes out. Now, what we just saw here are the masquerade that's supposed to be for entertainment. Now, for the fact that you are coming out as a masquerade that is for entertainment, doesn't mean that you are going to skip some precepts of masquerading. And one of those precepts is this, it's just like someone who is stepping out on a particular podium, you have to conduct yourself because despite the fact that it is for entertainment, in as much as you are putting on the mask, in as much as you are putting on the masquerade, it is assumed that you are a representative of the spirit, in quotes. Alright, so in our Igbo culture, Masquerades are not seen fighting along the road. There are a whole lot of videos that are on, on, on social media that have, that have caused a whole lot of stare online. And I just want to make the point this particular one because it bothers me. Yes, in the Igbo land, no masquerade is seen fighting. Not to talk of two or three masquerades fighting against themselves. What are you fighting for? Because at that point, it is assumed that you're not human. At that point, it is assumed that you are a spirit, in quote. So when you are in the mask, you are no longer Ikenna. Rather, you are Mao of this community. Do you understand? So it is no more Ikenna fighting against Chipike, but rather it is Mao versus Mao. I don't know whether you get the gist. So please, I just want to drop this reaction quickly. This is not our Igbo culture. A whole lot of things have come in and has scattered a lot of things concerning our culture and our tradition. So I just want to make this quick reaction for those of us who are not Igbos and who might probably misunderstand this to be one of the things that are cropping up in our Igbo culture. Thank you very much for giving me a listening. Do well to subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you will get first class notification as soon as we drop our new videos. Thank you very much.